I'm Mac Barnett. I'm John Clausen. And we made the book, How Does Santa Go Down the Chimney? Have you ever seen Santa Claus? Okay, I think I have. Traditionally on Christmas Eve, my mom and I used to like go out to dinner, see a movie, and we would stay out really late. And when we were driving back home, one night, very dark, lonely road, white beard, red suit, Santa Claus getting in to a Mitsubishi. <laughs> John, mm. at the tip of your pencil, Santa Claus undertakes several transformations, mm -hmm. either soft like caramel or volatile like fire, narrow or in the shape of a stamp. Mm. What did all these different steps of transformation allow you to do? It was fun to draw him because, like you say, he has white beard, red hat. You're basically good to go. You just have to do those in the various different shapes. And it was really fun to be like, that's still Santa Claus. I squished him, but you can still tell it's him. Does that answer the question? Yes. <laughs> have you ever thought about Santa Claus's loneliness? Yeah, I have. Yes, it's a lonely job. He you know, lives up in a remote area. He's got the elves. I don't know if they're great company. Uh, but I think he works very hard for, for other people, right? Uh, it must be very rewarding to work so far away from everybody all year round and then just really have one great night where, where all your hard work pays off and you make everyone happy. Is that the best night for him, you think? What do you think is a better night for Santa? Like, after that. Christmas night. Yeah, it's done. John? Mm. Through colors and shapes, <laughs> one has the impression that Santa is visually everywhere in the space of the page. How did you technically allow this feeling? I don't know. I don't know what... I don't know. There's a lot of black in the book, and I liked black for the night. I feel like up in the Arctic, there'd be a lot of big white snow and then a lot of black sky above it. It just felt like that lonely feeling, I think, is in the book. There's a lot of him being small and the sky being big. Um, but because he can fly, and because, you know, at least in, in, the, in the sleigh he can fly, and because he's kind of everywhere all at once in your house and in your chimney and we're not really sure where he is at any given time. He does feel like he's everywhere. He's like a ghost. Maybe he's dead. I don't know. We're not. He's not a dead Santa. I, at the end, we really wanted it to turn into that warmth, that coziness mm -hmm, mm -hmm. of Christmas. Because mm -hmm. that's what it's like in winter. He's also just a guy trying to get into your house. Okay, that's, thank you so much everybody and uh, we hope you enjoy the book.